Hello everyone, thanks for watching the video. My name is Azad Hasso and in this video we're going to show you how to add or install the preset in Lightroom. Uh, as you know, we already did the one version or uh, one video explain that in all version. I think uh, in April 2018, uh, Lightroom changed the, the way you could install or add uh, the preset in your Lightroom. So if you have an old version, we're going to show you. And also if you have a new version of Lightroom, we're going to show you as well how to use it as you know i sell a preset so and also i give away some free preset the people who subscribe to my channel and uh, my email list if you so if you would like to grab some free preset don't forget to subscribe to my channel just visit azadhasso.com or heads1.com and don't forget if you like this video uh, like it and subscribe and share it so it helps us a lot you know to make some more video like this so first of all uh, if you're in Lightroom, if you have a new version or old version, doesn't matter. So all you need to do is just go open your software, Lightroom. For for those who doesn't know, you know what's Lightroom. Lightroom basically is a software. is different than Photoshop. If you're a photographer or you take a lot of photo, and if you would like to organize them, this is the best software to organize your file on your photo and also at the same time even if you, you take horrible picture with this software it make it beautiful so right now I'm in my uh, uh, catalog you know I already created this catalog so if you library you're gonna see all this picture and all you need to do the to install the preset go to develop module you click in second tab and here in your left side you're gonna see the second option see preset all you need to do click in this arrow or this uh, triangle they're gonna open uh, some few preset probably you already have some of them some of them come free with the Lightroom so if you, right now we're gonna show you how to install it in old way or old version the old version is uh, uh, the extension is a uh, Lightroom temple so is it dot LR template so I'm gonna show you some now so like this in picture so the old version is gonna be like something like this and all you need to do to install one file or one preset all you need to do just click in this arrow then go import preset so as you see here I've got two different folder one is old one old template you can see here end with the uh, LR template as you can see, I've got two different folder. The first one, to heads1.com pro preset, all tem LR template. So I create these two folder. And if you buy it from me or you get it from me, you're probably gonna get it as a Z file. All you need to do, just click on it, uh, unstruct it, and you're gonna see some folder like this. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna install the first one. You're gonna click in the first one, 001. And you can see that all preset end up with all LR template. So let's say if you're gonna if you have just one preset, you're gonna click on it, or if you want to click all of them, you're gonna Command A or Control A, you click all of them. And this example, I'm gonna show you how to install just the first one and click Import. And as you can see here, user is gonna put it in a new folder called User Preset. So this option, if you have just one uh, folder or one few template and you want to install it in either way you know if you have old version or different version so right now i'm going to show you how to install a few different folder in lightroom either way if you have old version or new version so to do that all you need to do just go go to lightroom click preference if you're in mac if you're in windows you're going to click and edit preference so right now I'm using Mac, so I'm gonna do Lightroom preference. And here you're gonna give you two options: show Lightroom and develop preset or show Lightroom and other Lightroom preset. Either way, if you click on it, you're gonna open new folder or new window. So just gonna make it big to show you. So as you can see, right now I'm in library in Adobe. I'm gonna show Lightroom here. If if it's showing Lightroom, you're gonna click in Develop Preset, and here you're gonna show the preset on all version. So Lightroom 
then you're going to click in develop preset all you need to do i'm going to grab the old version this folder open all of them because as you can see all of them in template extension you can see all of them end with template so what i'm going to do for just to show you i'm going to put the last one 067 and 066 so i'm going to put this two template all you need to do just uh, if you want as i said command a to click or uh, to select all of them or uh, control a if you want in if you use in windows so as i said i'm going to choose two folder just to show you right click then click copy copy this two folder go back to develop preset and here click paste this two folder This two folder been downloaded. As you can see, if you click info, it is contained 256. The first one, the 66A uh, folder, and 67 one. If you click get info, you will see I've got 342 preset. So right now, just close it and close this window. And you need to come out of the Lightroom preset, then you're going to show up here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to exit from Lightroom. Open it again. So right now, we show you how to use the old version, if it is uh, the extension uh, LR template. If you have them, if you bought it, if you get it from somewhere. So if you do it this way, if you do it this way, it doesn't going to come up. So all you need to do, you need to click it manually. In this way, if you have an old version of a template, it's not gonna, you can't drag it and drop it in the folder. It does not gonna show up. But if you click import preset, you go to, let's say, go to desktop, click in the second folder, for example, this folder. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna click rename. I'm gonna copy this folder name but i'm going to click all of them click import so as you can see it import all of them in one go but the downside of this option is going to put it in user preset all you need to do right click on it rename it and put the folder name and click ok then this folder is changed the username is being changed to the the folder name and right now, if you want to do, add the second folder, right click on it, click import preset, go back again to the folder, it is in desktop, and let's choose the second one, for example, right click, rename, you're going to copy the name, click command A or control A if you're using Windows, click import, then you're going to automatically create new folder called user preset we're going to change the name to this name as you can see as another preset been installed right click on it rename it and this way is easier if you have a folder contain a lot of different preset as you can see in one click you could change if you see here navigate as well in one click you're going to change your image look So all different preset, as we said, we do sell them and also we give away some free one. All you need to do is just subscribe to our email list and we're going to give you some free of this preset. Uh, if you want to grab all of them for one go, it's more than uh, 10,000 uh, uh, file or presets. Some of them, you know, for beginners, some of them for advanced. So I like this one, for example. This is the first part. We show you how to use and install the Lightroom preset, the old version, the one contained LR template. And right now we're gonna show you how to uh, install or use the new version of Lightroom preset, the extension uh, called XMP. So from uh, April, 2018, the file structure in Lightroom is changed and the preset is changed as well. So you could, either do it the old way or the, I'm going to show you right now the new way. So 
to install the new version of a file all you need to do if you are using windows you go to edit preference and if you're on mac click in lightroom okay, choose preference and you're going to click on either of this one if you show lightroom develop it's going to take you to the setting one which is contain camera raw or if you want to show all other lightroom preset you click on it it's going to take you to lightroom and to to do it a new way the lightroom a new version create folder called camera raw you click on this camera row, go to the setting, and here you're gonna see the new version. As you can see, user preset, if you click on it, you're gonna see all the one you used previously is converted to XMP file. So this is new extension and Lightroom version, uh, 2018 version or above. So right now, what we're gonna do in the setting, we're gonna copy all this file the new one here on so i've got a lot of different file for example i'm going to choose number 10 and let's say i'm choose number one number two number three so i'm going to choose this five different file zero triple zero double zero zero one 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 so i'm going to choose all this what I'm going to do, either drag it and drop it, or I'm going to right click, click copy. Copy this six folder. I'm going to paste it here. So I'm going to close, come out of Lightroom. As you can see right now, I've got already the Lightroom preset. Few different, it's come free from Lightroom. And also I've got two different one here. And now we're gonna show you the easiest way and new way to add whole different folder in Lightroom and Neferman. Right? So all you need to do, just come out of Lightroom, open Lightroom again, it should update your preset library automatically. So if you click in preset, let's click this navigation. And here you can see, I've got six different folder been installed so this one we, we created the basic one for the beginner so all you need to do just one click and gonna change your picture looks in very simple easy way even if you beginner in Lightroom to get copy of our preset all you need to do just subscribe and I'm gonna send you some of this preset for free so that's it for this video we show you the old way to install the preset in your Lightroom and also we show you the new way uh, if you as i said if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and like this video and share it and also if you want to get copy some uh, free of this preset don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also to our email list and we're going to send you for free thank you and see you next video peace